Hi guys, it's Debbie. It's been a little while since I vlogged and um, how sweet some of you are saying, where's Debbie? Where's Debbie doing another vlog? That's so sweet, you guys. Thank you. Um, so I thought I would come on and do a quick little vlog and give an update for you. It is Wednesday, hump day. Uh, I think it's the 27th of May, I think. And I'm in my, I believe, second week of or going into my third week, I believe, of P3. And basically, guys, I'm having fun. I'm loving life. And I know that can sound so silly, like I'm loving life, I'm embracing life, and so happy, And but I really am. And I feel great. I'm, I'm loving on my body. Uh, thankfully, that feels wonderful. I am, just really filled with joy. I know it's so corny, but I, I just really am. I'm having, I'm having a good time. Um, I have, I, you know, question has been asked, what am I eating? Am I pop? Have I had to do a steak day? And, um, yes, I've had to do a steak day twice. Do they work? Yes. Amazing. Do I want to be cautious and not let that become a habit? Yes, I want to be cautious and not let that become a habit. I think that's too easy to say, okay, well, I'm going to play and then I can just do a steak day and make up for it. Ah, I just don't want to go there. I think that's that's where it's a slippery slope for me where I start saying, okay, I'm going to play and I'm going to play and I'm going to play and, 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 and I lose track of who I really am. But who I really am is the health and fitness girl. You know, I work out on a daily basis. I love my moving my body in a purposeful manner uh, for health reasons every single day. And I am doing that. I'm, I'm fully back into that. I'm, <laughs> I was doing a pilot, uh, fitness challenge while the, while I was in P2 and now we actually have launched the corporate challenge worldwide and I'm I'm fully entrenched in that and enjoying it and you know being a leader in that you know because I've got to represent you know uh, since I was involved in the pilot and I love that so that's causing me to do a, a lot of movement and having fun uh, I'm as far as eating I'm eating very healthfully with the exception of you know, a couple of times I uh, was not following protocol 100% P3 protocol, which is funny because I'm the, some some people have said I was the pop princess because <laughs> so adamant about following protocol perfectly while I was injecting the home hormone. And now that I'm not injecting the hormone, I'm not as afraid of what might happen. But that's kind of silly actually because P3 is ex incredibly critical for long-term weight maintenance on this so but but honestly I haven't been perfectly on protocol p3 protocol the whole time but I haven't messed up very much and it's been on rare occasion and usually just when there's a, a social thing like last Saturday was a birthday party and and you know I had some potatoes that I shouldn't have had and some whole grain crackers with the cheese um, that kind of slip up but nothing really catastrophic uh, my weight is pretty much stabilizing, you know, thanks to those two steak days, but hovering around 129, which is, which is fine. My LIW is 127.8, so 129 is okay. The other night, my husband surprised me with a really nice dinner out and went to this farm to table restaurant. It was so amazing. And they had bison on the menu which is incredible. It's such a great lean red meat, just full of nutrients. And then for the side, they had cauliflower mashed potatoes or cauliflower mashers, which is so great. I took a picture of it um, and sent it to a friend. So I'm gonna insert that here. You can see, you know, it was an incredible dinner out at a really nice farm to table restaurant. That was a great night. I had two glasses of wine with my husband. We shared a bottle. Um, uh, as far as other things I'm eating, just healthy, healthy, lots of vegetables, good healthy proteins, cooking with my fave coconut oil. Here's a picture of my lunch from today, just from today, spontaneously, I, I took a, a picture of it because I like taking pictures of my meals sometimes. This was a pork chop leftover from last night. I had the exact same meal. This was a replica of um, what I ate last night. 
on Sunday I grilled up some baby bell peppers and some mushrooms and onions and my coconut oil and you know prepped that because I knew I would use it throughout the week and then made a big pile of steamed asparagus and so I've just been been macking on that and getting good healthy nutrients through that here's a picture of my lunch from today which is exactly the same as my dinner last night So you can see just eating good food, nutritious, moving my body, I, you know, gotta keep these muscles going and keep my heart pumping the way it should be. Uh, most importantly though, just really loving, loving life, embracing life, embracing my body. I had an opportunity to really embrace embrace my body and, and cherish it uh, by way of a non-scale thing because I don't want to get too obsessed with the scale, you know, even though we are weighing every day and I do weigh every day to make sure that I stay on point. But I don't want that to be my whole focal point, you know. It's like, how am I feeling in my clothes? How is my energy level? How do I feel as I'm eating this healthy food? That type of thing. So I, just this past a couple of days, I was doing a lot of shopping because my sister-in-law is getting married this Saturday, and we're headed up north to go to her wedding, and I had to find just the right dress. So I went to Macy's. I love Macy's because they have such great sales and stuff, and. I wound up coming home with like eight different dresses and because I, I found such great deals and they just fit so wonderfully and everything and so I uh, did a little model show for my husband and he liked them all and thought that they fit great and the one that I selected I just think is so amazing so I'm gonna insert uh, the photos I did it, it was funny because I wanted my husband to take the pictures of me and he goes no the lighting's bad why do you always want me to take pictures when it's dark and the lighting's bad and and so I took it upon myself to go upstairs and and do this makeshift you know I did a self timer and took the photos of myself and jumping up on my bathtub with the photo timed and it, it was kind of crazy but it worked and the lighting isn't that great but you can see the dress and there's one in particular that I love it's it's the, from the back view and I love this photo of me in this dress because it shows my beautiful womanly curves you know I like to be thin but I love the fact that I have curves and I embrace those curves and I always will have them you know um, and and I love that so I'm gonna show those photos because when I when I put on that dress and I was just you know feeling great I was just feeling great and embracing my body and just loving loving life and feeling that bliss you know I'm always seeking bliss and that's kind of where I'm at right now just bliss so um, I'm gonna go ahead and insert those pictures right here of the dress. So you can see the lighting's not so good, but isn't it nice? I, you know, I'll insert one that, um, wasn't on the bathtub because it just shows the color so much better. It's a beautiful pink. So anyway, uh, just some fun there with, with the photos of my food and me from my shopping trip and my little dress that I picked out. But, you know, having fun, not trying to be obsessed with anything, embracing life, embracing my body being very very thankful loving this community I'm enjoying watching all of your vlogs I see that we have some new people oh, we have new people and then we have people that have returned and I'm so excited to watch all of you and get to know you better and uh, just let's just all be there and support one another and let's love and embrace ourselves where Ever we are in our journey and you know p3 gosh darn it's hard um, to try to stabilize that weight but um, I'm having fun with it and I'm trying to just be really balanced anyway take care guys much love to all of you hugs and kisses <laughs> bye